following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE United Kingdom Championship. WWE's top star is ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. superstar who derives as much pleasure from hurting their opponent as Pete Dunne does. Introducing the challenger from Miami, Florida, weighing in at 204 pounds, the innovator, Shaw Jackson. Introducing the champion from Birmingham, England, weighing in at 205 pounds, he is the WWE United Kingdom Champion, Pete Dunne. Don't change that dial. two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. If Pete Dunne is one thing, it's tenacious. Ouch. The Bruiserweight's natural instinct is to always attack his opponent. The assaults that follow are devastating to a superstar's well-being. Forget about winning or losing the match. And he goes for the cover. And the champ kicks out. Not yet. Nailed it. And the steam. Tear the features clean off your face. You gotta believe this one's over. He's got him covered. And the champ kicks out. Still too fresh. Yeah. 
Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself into this mess. Well, he's got to get himself out of it now. Into the Hurricane Rana. Nicely done. Knee drop. is all about the intimidation. He's a man of few words, but actions like holding that United Kingdom championship in his teeth as he glares at his competition down the ramp sends a message to his opposition. Knocks <laughs> up. Pele kick! Victory is on the horizon. Bringing back up Pete Dunne's penchant for intimidation, I'm fine with sending a message during his entrance, but his attacks before and after the bell rings just cross the line. I disagree, Saxton. While most of Dunne's United Kingdom Championship Tournament's opposition were excited for the opportunity and happy to be in front of an English crowd, the bruiserweight showed everyone he wanted it more with those brutal beatdowns. into the cart with energy strike. What a combination. Nobody oh, controls man. the pace of a match quite like this guy. Boom! We might be looking at a new champ here. Uh-oh. Look at this. Goodness. There's the knee right to the face. Oh, man. What a splash. Snap suplex. Very nice. Oh, oh yeah, I love this. Ball in. Oh. Here's his moment, Michael. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. Harsh impact. Just when you thought he had nothing left. One, two. What? What's he doing? Every superstar remembers their first match on Raw, but for Pete Dunne, Byron, his first match has a little extra special meaning as it took place in his home country of England. Well, not only that, Michael, but Pete Dunne also walked away from that match with a decisive victory. We've seen this before. <laughs> Game, set, match. This one is over.
We already established that Pete Dunne was successful in his first Raw match, but to me, the biggest takeaway from that was that the 23-year-old didn't exhibit an ounce of nervousness in front of a sellout crowd of nearly 15,000 in his home country on a big show like Monday Night Raw. That's because Dunne oozes confidence. He was dominant that night because he knows it's just a matter of time before he'll be back on Raw and in the main event, most likely. Going all the way up. He might have it. Look out! Oh, nasty impact. The champ's in a real bad place right now. The cover. One, two, three. We have the crowning of a new champion. A lot of good action in that one. Here's another look. These guys showed flashes in this match, but flashes don't exactly set the world on fire, as these highlights show very well. This match wasn't exactly a barn burner, but we can't expect every superstar to be on their A game every time, I guess. to the highlight reel. I don't make the matches, but if I did, I'd put these two back in the ring ASAP. What an amazing match. As usual, this Philadelphia crowd is beyond boisterous tonight. Thank you, everybody, for tuning in.